So let's talk a bit about technique. Sealer. When you have in the right amount of sealer, you have in way too much sealer. When you think you have far too little sealer, you have the right amount. Why? Because you'll be creating the best, tightest seal you've ever created before. More gutta percha than ever before. More gutta percha means less sealer required. Okay? So there's definitely learning curve here. Really try to limit the amount of sealer. You do not need a tremendous amount of sealer. You need very, very little. How do I know when I feel I have the right amount of sealer? When I put the sealer in and I take out with paper points, typically not one paper point, but one, look at it, another, look at it, and it looks like there's very little or no sealer coming back out, and I look in the canal under the microscope and it looks like there's just a very small, small amount inside, that's what I think is the right amount. So a very small amount of sealer required in order to use this technique. You want to pull out any excess. So placing sealer in with a paper point into the mesial buccal canal. Just a little bit of pumping action. We do want to move it around. I do want to coat the entire canal surface if possible. And then with a series of paper points, I'm going to bring that back out. And it should look pretty clean. Same thing then in the mesial lingual canal. And I would go just a little bit more there. I would take out just a wee bit more than what the video shows. And now the same thing in the distal. But you can see the effort that's made to coat the entire canal surface, even though that's quite a bit now, and now pulling more out. And again, I would blot off that extra at the orifice level. 